What is going on? We are back for episode number three. It might sound a little echoey. Currently having my living room done. It's currently just been plastered, so it's very echoey in the room I'm in right now. So if that echoes a lot, I do apologise. But we're getting straight into this episode with the EFL Cup round two, I believe this is. Yes, round two, the AFL Cup. We are at home to Oldham, so it should be a comfortable win. We are going to rotate the team a lot because we have a lot, a lot of knackered players that we're overusing at the minute. So we are going to have a, a big swap around so Vidra can get on. Morley will drop to the bench. Uh, Aaron Lennon can go in instead of Cornet. We'll bring Cork in. We're literally going to swap the whole team here, guys. Collins can come in for Tarkowski. You know, we'll leave Pope because for some reason keepers just don't seem to lose stamina on his on their career mode. Very strange, but we'll leave that as it is. So it is a it's quite a weak team we're playing. We're gonna have a weak bench as well. We're just gonna throw these onto the bench. Just because we don't wanna have to use them at all. Who else can we put on there? You know what? We'll give this geezer can go on the bench. Ball stick. Rodriguez can come back into the team. Westwood, actually, he might. You know what? We'll take Barzi out. We'll, we'll start Westwood over Stevenson. I think that's an okay team. McNeil, oh, I feel like maybe I should rest him too. But there's not really any options there. I am lacking a bit in a few departments here, but we'll go with what we've got. That will do nicely. World class, five minutes. Let's get into this game. I think even with the team we're putting out, we should still comfortably be winning this game, I think. Oh, let's go. I think uh, Pegoros up front is going to have an interesting game. He's an absolute monster. I like he's going to torture this Oldham defence. Hopefully we have a better episode than episode two. Didn't go too bad, but we did have that massive absolute battering from Blackburn. Of course, uh, first shot on target after three minutes. So it's a poor one, but it's a shot on target. As I was saying, yeah, we had that massive battering to Blackburn when they beat us 4-1. It was annoying because we had more shots, we had more possession. Everything, it just wasn't working for us. Ah, oh, he's gone offside. I did play the, the ball earlier, but it, it took a while to go through there. Megos already finding a lot of the ball. Oh, we can't find Megos. Just a bit short in the pass. Go on, Megos, make that run. I see it, I see it. No, he's on, he's on. No, no, no. Yes. No. No, I'm sure I was on sorry. Just have a bit. Ah, this big size 25 feet has just gone offside. Not getting that last ball in. Final ball is important, isn't it? Go on, let him make the run, make the run. See, he took it past his. Oh, that's, that's a bad one. Lennon's lacking a bit of strength there, he's pushing the ball a bit easily. Balance, poor ball into the box. We've won it straight back. Ruthless pressing here. McNeil takes a touch. Great block. Great block. Bend me actually, I didn't swap him out. I should, should have swapped him out. Ben Lee gets to start then. I feel like that was a bit of a unnecessary save there. I don't feel like he needed to make a save right. Maybe he could have left it or caught that. Oh, what have I done there? Have I backed off? Did nothing with that. Nothing. We break with Aaron Lennon. Legos is making that run. 
a hold up play. So Lennon comes through. Lennon, Westwood. Oh, I'm going for the shot, Westwood. Ooh. A bad effort, a good save from the keeper. Looks it in. Oh, it's a great save. Regos is there. Oh. Surely he would have been the keeper there. Surely. Straight back, that's what we love to see. But then we give it away. Okay. Don't let him get into the box. Oh, I committed to a tackle which I didn't get. There we go. Come on, Lennon. Westwood, two new defender. Play in, cork, shoot. Oh, he hit the crossbar. They trap. Oh. We need to put a goal away, boys. This is going to be one of those games where no matter how much we dominate, last kick of the game is something they're going to score. I'm going to rage. And that will be the end of this Burnley Crane Road. <laughs> no, it won't actually. It would be very, very frustrating. It was all day, all day, every day of the week. Vegos is doing running down the wing, but that was a good ball. Oh, we're going to aim for Vegos here. Oh, it doesn't go to. Oh, we just can't score. Everything's blocked. It hits the crossbar. The keeper makes a mad save. But, uh, I hope it's not going to be one of those games. Vidra. Go on, Vidra. Touch, I knew it by that last little touch then. Gonna get blocked. Don't let the cross come in. Ah, Pep's got that all day. Great ball. It's a great ball again, Vidra's through. He's through, can he place it? Ah, oh, yes, beautiful. Just before half time, we take the lead. It's been coming now, hasn't it, guys? It's been coming. We have been very, very dominant. Vidra, he's been an alright player for us. He can annoy us sometimes with the chances he misses. But he's, he's been alright. Yeah, I think he might even be a top goal scorer, actually, so far for us. Right, that's it, half time. We go in leading 1 0. I'm guessing we're probably absolutely dominating possession as well. Probably dominating all the stats. Because we have been fully in control of this game. Let's have a little look. So, okay, we've only had 53% possession. I thought we'd be in the 60s, not gonna lie. But we have had nine shots to their zero. Corners two. Offsides, we've had two. That's something we need to get out of our game. But I'd say we're pretty comfortable. We'll carry on as we are. Maybe on the 55th, 60th minute, I'll bring on some other players if if we've got that second goal. It's still 1-0. I might not make that many changes. If we get that second, though, it could be, give us a chance to give some minutes to players that probably won't feature much this season. Neil to Cork. Cork to Veghorst. Veghorst. Oh, it's hit the crossbar. Of course, plays in Aaron Lennon. Aaron Lennon's going to whip it in. Oh, it's a poor ball. Lennon has not got a whip on him. He is gone. He's past it now, I think. He needs to hand his boots up. Hudson Adoy to Newcastle. Interesting. That could be a move that I could see. With the money they've got coming in, I could see him possibly bringing him in. Big block. That's not a good ball out, but we keep possession. That's all that matters. Oh, Westwood. Oh, my gosh. Make that run. Don't you? 
Come on, I want to play that ball to you. Ah, oh, there you go. She didn't move, you bus. You just stayed there. What is that? So, what? What's going on with the passing here? It's like they're broken. Dropped off him. We dropped off and we've let him go straight through the middle of us. It's so poor that is. Hook's gonna come off. Gomez and Cini is gonna come on. See if he can just give us something different in that midfield. I committed with my player and I dragged myself away then. It just just made so much space in the middle there for him to run through. And it's 1-1 in a game which we should be miles ahead. They drip oh, locked again. We do not want to replay here. We do not want to be wasting more players' energies. We've got some confidence now, Alden. They believe they can do this, they believe they can cause the upset. There we go, play that. Oh my god. Jesus. We're, we're not playing well at all here. Come on, Legos. Use that strength. He's through. Go on, the square's on. Play it across. Goal, come on. Get it in. It's Vidra again. We'll be second of the game. Absolutely crushing those hearts of those Olden fans. And that was simple. We're just making silly mistakes. Good job. What can we do here? Go over as we see. Looking for the options. Let out wide. Let's get that ball in. Corner, we'll take the corner. See if we can get it on there, Gorsi's massive head. He's heading towards him. Ah, he's not even gone for it. Go, Viz Mancini shoots. Oh, it's blocked again. He must have been like a 10th block of the game. Whip it in. Oh, there goes his attack. Give it. Femme's done well there. Oh, that is poor. Lennon is just not what I want. Lauten, that is beautiful. Shut off. Oh, that's a brilliant save. Let's bring on Stevens. The CDM. Go play it, Lennon. Lennon's. He's just not going to make it That defender's done really well against Vegas on this point. Stop Vegas getting on to every single one. Big tackle. And I've won myself the throw in there. Brilliant. Last kick of the game. Are they going to bring their keeper? They're not. I'm very surprised they haven't brought their keeper. Oh, they've run the head a bit. 
That is full time, 2-1. Not a convincing win. Not all, it should have been. It should have been a very comfortable win, but a win's a win. We will take it. We progress into the EFL Cup round three. Let's skip the talks. We'll, we'll go into talk, guys, if things are going very bad and we need to boost morale up. But right now, we're not doing too bad, so we'll keep at it. So, let's keep advancing on. Um, let's have a look at these transfer offers. So, Taylor, there's an offer of 6.2 million, but he is very important for us right now. Uh, I don't really want to let him go. You know what? Let's be realistic. We'll delegate. We'll say 9.2 or at least 8 mil. If they come back with 8 mil, he can go. Let's have a look at these scouts. So let's shortlist this guy. We'll shortlist him as well. He looks like he could be solid for us. These looking like some good players, but we still haven't got the, the funds to ring these in right now. Maybe next season, if we carry this on, maybe we look at bringing these in. Definitely not Ryan. He's way too expensive. Same with him. We ain't, we ain't going to have 33 million. Uh, we'll shortlist you, even though I don't think we're going to be able to afford you. Have we shortlisted you already? We do. Curtis Jones, get lost. Sessignon. Hmm. I, nah, he's not going to come to Burnley, is he? Surely not. Ashley Barnes, mate, you're not playing. Oh, Derby next. Wayne Rooney's Derby. Very big game. Ben Mee's a little bit knackered. Uh, can we swap him out? Yeah, we'll swap him out with Collins. We'll give Collins to start this game. Yeah, Peter's had a good game last game. So if it comes to it and we have to put him in over... Taylor, we'll do it if we do sell Taylor, but right now let's try and not sell him. Apart from that, let's jump straight into this game. Away at Derby County. Big game. Let's try and get ourselves three points. I believe it's the second game for a recent signing, Bodu. Scored in his debut, let's see if he can grab another. Obviously, Corne is our star player. Oh, it's a good ball. Well read by Tarkowski there. Oh, that's a brilliant tackle on William Lipic. Start a counter attack to Derby here. Don't let him get it across goal. Oh! Bloody hell, I thought that was in. Looking dangerous from the off here. Hope's out to collect that easy work. Good kick. Looking for Bregan. Bregankin, Bregankin. Never say this guy's name. I need to find out what his first name is. Well, I might just start calling him Bragg. Go on, Bragg. Got in, Tarkowski. Oh, that's poor. Awful passing. I see him again. I see him making that run. Look at him. Go on, Morley. Oh, what a header. That is beautiful. Absolute banger from Morley. Made in Burnley. Plays for Burnley. He's going to become a Burnley legend. What a header that is. Morley's on the score sheet. 12 minutes in. Gives us that, that first goal away at Derby. Massive for us this. Let's try and build on that now. Let's not make any silly mistakes. Not let them back into the game. Oh, that's good play. Ah, oh, we've let him straight back in. Instant response from Derby. Brilliant play as well, passing it around. 
It's like a pinball table. Left, right, left, right. I didn't know where to look. Kazim Richards for the equaliser. Oh, we've got to do it all over again now. I just wanted to sprint in front. I didn't want to do that massive Goliath touch. We are struggling to get the ball here. You see the bit of composure. A bit of composure. Yeah, a hold on the game. Morley plays it in. Bragg. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Wait, that's his first goal of the game. I was about to get well annoyed because Bodhi just wouldn't latch onto it. But it doesn't matter. Big man Bragg. Braganka. Oh, a 2 1. We love it. Now let's not concede straight away. Let's hold on to this lead for a change. Morley. Ah, a bit too much for Bodie there. He can't get onto that. There we are. I love that. Bodie, go on, make that run. Oh, Bodie, this is beautiful. The fake shot. Ah, oh, just too much to be true. Bag. I'm just playing around with it. He's just toying with him. Let's not rush this. Up in McNeil. Morley's there. Oh, it's a brilliant save. doesn't matter. Roberts gets back, but then he gives him the ball straight back when he's there to get it again. Ooh, a little slide tackle. That looked a bit dirty. That did look like he was trying to take out my ankle. We're going to put it back for the foul now. Oh, James Arkowski, you unit. How does it get that in? I tried to turn away to try to try win the, the free kick there, but he's still well to just nick that. Ah, oh, come on, McNeil, get that ball through. What is he doing? Half time, and we lead 2 1. Too shabby. It's fair, we haven't been massively great here. We definitely haven't had the most possession. We have had the most possession 56%. Nah. Something must be up with these possession stats. There's no way we've had that. We've had more shots. Okay, I can see that. But they just seem to be tidy with the ball. A bit more composure on the ball. Like they don't look. Like they're panicking when they're on it. Big brag. He scored the second, but he's going to have to come off because he's absolutely shattered. I need to have a look at what his um, stamina and stuff like because he's always, he's got 70. He runs out every game at half time. Court can come on. Aaron Lennon is going to have to come on for McNeil because he's shattered as well. And that's where we'll leave that for now. See if Lennon can uh, do any better than he did against Oldham because he was an absolute shambles in that game. 
point, a lot of players in the scene, they do something good, make a good tackle, and then they pass straight after it. It's horrendous. Cork then, comes on at half time, makes a brilliant tackle instantly. Passes the ball back. Oh, good ball. Brilliant save play, but he's offside, so it doesn't matter. Right, let's get the ball. Let's keep it. String some passes together. All this space, so we slow it down. It's onside, surely. Yes, Borne. Play across. Oh, what a block! That's surely a goal by Bodu if he doesn't get that block. I feel like my manager looks a bit of a mix of like Conte, Giroud, someone else. Anyone else see that? Whip that corner in. Oh, it's beautiful. Off the corner. Who is that? I don't know who scored that. Taylor, the guy that we are potentially looking to sell. Potentially Porto. It'll be a big loss, but 8 million, that, that could be used somewhere else. Could be used to bring in a younger player. Maybe not as high rated, but younger potentially to grow with us. I don't know. I think you have some left backs that are very young. We won't cost stupid amount, but I can't think right now. Oh, come on, ref, we've just both slipped. I can't like that. Go on. Bodu, is that? Yes, Bodu's making that run. Go on. Composure now, composure. Oh, it's a big save. Maybe I shot too early. Still a good save from the keeper. And we've proven already this um, this series that corners are deadly for Burnley. We are very effective off them. Oh, big save. Oh my God, is this game having a laugh? Is this game taking the absolute nick? What is happening? Makes that range of save, and then we hit the. Is it the crossbar we hit? Oh, next fixture is home to Cardiff. Big game again. Every game is a big game in this championship. We don't want to be dropping any points. Taylor whips it in. Bodu! Oh, Taylor gets it back. Falls to Brano. The cork, cork shoots. Good save on the keeper. We've been so much better this second half. We look so much more dangerous. You know, we've scored less goals. We look a lot more threatening. Turns his defender. Oh, he just hasn't got the pace to keep going. All the stamina by looks, looks like he was getting tired there. That's a great play from Garby this. Oh, that's Pope's all day. Pope! Catch that. No, oh, there we go, he's messed it up again. Oh, no. Oh, that was absolutely disgusting. We scored anyway, but... Oh, if that went in for Morley, that was goal of the season. The flick over the defender's head, the volley. Oh, off the crossbar as well, but we've scored anyway. Bodu gets another. No, gets his first, actually, hasn't scored. That is absolutely filthy. Oh, I can't believe that's not gone in. But we'll take it. Bodu scores. 4-1. This is a very comfortable game. You know? now what, let's make some subs. Morley, fun lucky lad, but you're going to come off. And then that's our third sub, isn't it? So, yeah, Vidra. And Super Sub. Who scores a lot of goals off the bench. 
Ayrada. Just about. Bodu, I see you. I see you, Bodu. I see you. Oh! That's the second of the game, I believe. 5 1. We are demolishing Derby Cat here. This will be a lot of confidence going into our next game. That. It's nearly gone out for a corner. That makes no sense. It's nearly gone out for a corner of his shot. I meant to say it's nearly gone out for a throw in. What am I showing? Am I right? Okay, not with like that. Scrappy there, but we win 5 1. That's our biggest win so far of the series. Away from home as well, that is very, very impressive from the boys. Love it. We're getting the champagne out tonight, lads. Here we are, we're coming to the end of the transfer window. We'll see if we do end up losing anyone. It's going to be hard to get them quickly replaced now, though. Is it off of the cook? You know what, he is just a rotation player. Do we let him go? Uh, let's say we let him go for like 3 million. We'll get like 2 million off that. That will give us, what? Oh, we've got nothing. We just can't get a replacement for that. For like 3 million. I don't think we'll be able to bring someone in. Oh, we're going to have to say no at the moment. Reject that. We'll ignore that for now. That's a budget of zero. That's not ideal. In Kunku to Man United for 107 million. He would be a mental signing for Man United. He would be impressive. Especially if they got Frankie de Jong as well. Imagine two centre mids of Frankie de Jong and I don't know who would they play. Bruno, I guess. And then in Kunku just in front. Maybe. Sancho out on the right, on the left. If you can get Rashford back in form, he would be vital. But if you can't get him in form, maybe like a Langer or they bring someone else in. Up front, Cristiano Ronaldo. That would be insane. But then again, look at the Man United team of last season. Looked insane, performed horrendous. It's always boring this bit, isn't it? Skipping through. Peters. Who wants Peters then, eh? You're... You've not put a bad offer in, actually. But, uh, we don't really have any other left-back options, I don't think, when Taylor's knackered. I think for me to sell some certain players, it's going to have to be a mental offer that I can't say no to. Four hours to go. Oh, no, he's gone. Oh no, 8.5 million. I don't think I can say no to that, guys. Oh, oh we're accepting it. Ah, oh, no, we need to quickly look for a left back. Oh, I don't think, okay, I've got one on, on the go. Uh, oh, he's not being scouted, no. Ah, do we have any in the shortlist? Please be some in the shortlist. The Jew, you look very good, but 13 to 19 mil, we don't have that. Will they loan you? Oh, they don't want to loan you. This is not... Oh, okay, you can play centre-back. Do they want to loan you? No, they don't want to loan you, of course. Ah, this is not good. This is not, not, not good. You know what? Let's start looking at leagues. 
I think we're going to have to get someone on loan for now. Arsenal, let's have a look. Who have you got then? Left back. Uh, is that all you've... No, okay. Ooh. No, what? Let's try and loan in. No! Just let me loan someone! Please! Okay, let's try another club. You want to try the bigger teams because they've usually got a lot of players that they're not going to be using. Uh, Chelsea have no one. What is that about? How about Liverpool? Uh, they're not going to loan him, are they, really? Let's, let's be realistic here. They're not going to loan him out. Damn it! Ah, these don't look too great. I don't think I'm going to try City. Okay, what about United? Come on, United, you've got someone you can loan me, surely. Um, tell us. That's, what? they got one left back? Hey. Surely not. What's going on there then? Aha, oh, this is not going good. Newcastle, you got any left backs? Jamal Lewis. Oh, I don't think you're going to let me have him, are you? Ah, what have we done here? How have we messed this up? Let's, let's see if Jamal Lewis will come. Don't, I feel like, uh, I don't know. We need to wait for the money to come in anyway because we can't do anything right now. We're sitting on zero. This is going to be tight if we can bring a replacement. If it comes to it, we'll have to just um, rock with Peters, but uh, it's a bit annoying, but it's enough that we can't really turn down. Why are they taking so long to get this to go through? We've got an hour. Has it gone through? Okay, it's gone. They've given me six mil. What? Ah, oh, guys. Oh, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Ah, damn it. Um. Ah. Uh, I don't know who to look for. Do we just keep going through these clubs? Spurs, have you got anyone? Okay, he hasn't even got a face there. So let's not look at him. Break it on now. You know what? Let's let's try with session on again. Okay, how about oh you gotta be looking between sixteen to twenty four million. Are they okay? I can't afford that. I'm bloody Burnley. Oh, God, I don't know what to do here, guys. I'm in a sticky one here. I don't know what to do. Uh, West Ham. They haven't got anyone. Fantastic. Uh, you know, I'm just having a little look at players I could potentially look to bring in. So I'm going to go to the Bundesliga to Leipzig. And there's a little player in here. 
by the name of Josco Gavardial, I believe his name is. This guy, I believe he can play at left back. Maybe we try loan him. Approach a nope. Okay. Maybe we approach to buy him with our six mil, which I don't think they are going to want. I feel like they're going to tell me I'm an idiot and they're insulted. I feel like I've wasted my time. Fair enough. Okie dog. I also feel like I've wasted your time and I feel awful. Sorry. I am very sorry. I don't know what to do. I just don't know who to bring in. You know what? Let's go and have a look in the championship where we are. Oh, well, we look at a bit of Coventry. I'm pretty sure they've got a an all right potential left back. I can't remember what his name is, though. What is your name? I think it's this guy, Ian Matson. I feel like he's got a quite high potential. Mm, I feel like he goes into like the high 80s. Well, not high 80s. Like low 80s, sorry, like 83 or something. You know what? Let's 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 try and buy him. I don't know what to offer. That. Oh, is that say Chelsea are in. Wait, he's at Chelsea. What? Oh, he's currently out on loan. No, stop doing me like this. Ah, oh, he doesn't need a left back. Stop doing this to me. Get him off loan. Send him to me. So I could have got him on loan if I wasn't an idiot. I am an idiot. Guys, I don't know what to do here. I don't know what to do. Uh, I'm just trying to desperately find a player. Oh, look at this guy here. Luker Nets. This guy here. A release clause of that. So if I shortlist him and view him. Okay, I don't want to do that. So, his release clause is 10.5 mil. So, if I approach to buy, 6 mil should be... It's probably way over. You know what? Let's start with 4.5. Uh, can't wait. We're not, you're not having a 2% sell-on clause. I'll give you the 5.8, though. Yes, okay. Okay. We are under something here. He's probably only like 68 rated or 69 or something like that. Or 70 at the push. Probably not 70 actually. He's probably in the 60s. But uh, what's his wage at the moment? We don't know. Okay. Fantastic. Please just tell me what you want. You are going to be crucial because you're, you're 18. We'll, we'll put you straight in the, f the first team. We'll give that run out. We want you for four years. Yeah, that's what we're looking for. Fantastic. Yeah, we don't want a release clause either. You want a two and a half grand wage. You know what? Have it. Go on then, what rating are you? Like 63? He's going to be awful, isn't it? 72! You know what? I'm happy with that. 18 years old, 72 rated. I'm very happy with that rating. Okay. Let's get him straight into this team. He's already matching so he's a left wing back that's left mid so maybe we we change him to a left back quickly in the development hood so squad hub where are you there you are development plan how long will it take to make you just a left back two weeks yep brilliant all right, let's get into the next game. We have waffled on for too long here. It's Cardiff City. 
let's just get into it. Okay, I say that, and then the youth squad comes up. Is there any good players we can take out of this? Uh, there's a left back that we wanted. <laughs> He's only potentially 84, though. Not great, but it's not bad. Let's just ignore this, because we just want to play FIFA. Let's play some career mode. Oh, God. No, transfer windows ended. I'm not even entertaining any of this. Czech Republic, sorry. I'm not interested. You know what? Let's manage interruptions. Let's just bypass all this for now. Let's just get to the game because it's taking too long. All right, Cardiff City at home. Let's just get into this game. We're going to start with this team. It's been going very well. This is quite a long episode. Currently, I've not been editing my videos down. I've just been literally sticking them up raw straight from Twitch to YouTube. If you guys want me to edit it, so it's just literally like goals or good chances, stuff like that. You know, and I can do that, but for now, I haven't been. Right, let's get into this. So far, we are on a 100% win record for this episode. Obviously, not for the season, because we had that loss to Blackburn, but for this episode, we haven't lost yet. Looking good. What's he trying from there? Is he all right? Oh, 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 I saw him making the run straight across. As soon as I pressed A, he started running. Oh, just over. Ah, I'm living dangerously there. No, just clear that ball, Pope. What's going on? Hey, these are all over me right now. Oh, dude. I see Morley. Take that first time shot. Oh, it's blocked. What a shot. What a shot. That is an awful pass. Absolutely rifled it. What is happening here? Put it in. Ah, oh, there's no one there. Brag gets it to Bodu. Bodu was just looking for the opportunity, but he's not coming. Brownhill plays it in. Bra oh. I'm just trying to find the right opportunity for it to open up. Didn't want to force a shot and get it blocked with all the others. Oh, it's going to play. Ah, uh, we're 1-0 down. Ah, uh, it's not great. Really not good. Cardiff take the lead. As they look to get promotion to the Premier League as well, they are probably up there with some big odds. Obviously, it's been quite a few years now since they have been in the Premier League. But let's try and stop those chances. I don't think they'll go up. I reckon it'll be us, Watford, and probably Norwich, the teams that have come down. I'm hoping we can get. Oh, wow. Maybe we can win the league, but 
I'll be happy with top two with that automatic promotion. I'd rather not go through the playoffs, but if we have to do it that way, let's do it. And then if we don't get promotion or playoffs at all, then something's gone horribly wrong. They're getting too many chances here. We need to tighten up. Come on, call it. I that one. I see it. Right, whip it in. Corde with the ball in. Oh, it's a brilliant save. Come on. Oh, she's not going in. What is it with the keepers? People are getting some steroids. Absolute crackheads. Ref. Get the cards out, lad. Oh, that is awful. Corner it is. Big save from Pope. How has he got that much space at the back post? Two nil. Give me a fucking break. How are we two nil down there at home? This is horrendous. It's just so easy. We are really struggling there. I'm after being switch up a half time. Not really created that much. Obviously, we've had the one one chance possibly. I think that we should have scored, but apart from that, we haven't really done anything to test this defence out of Cardiff. We're giving the ball away so easily as well. This could be another Blackburn game if you're not careful. Right, it's half time. We are 2 0 down. We need to change something here because we're just not creating anything. I'm thinking maybe we, we change formation. We go for a 4 3 3 attack. Let's get coordinated up there. McNeil could come off. Aaron Lennon's not much faster, but we'll bring him on. Moy going there, these two here. And then if it's not working, we'll bring on the big man Vegos up there. Maybe Vidger in here. But Vegos there just so we can get those balls whipped in. Try and play a different sort of game. Come on. Come on, Burley. done too much, I've just ran in the straight line. I should have just passed it. Oh do! Oh, he's at the bar! It's just really not meant to be. Norwich. 
Drops it into corners there. How is the keeper saying this again? Honestly, what is going on? This is actually a joke, guys. What is happening? Why are the keepers saving everything? It's actually annoying. What have you got to do to score past these? I think we need we need the big man in. Maybe bring him in there. We'll leave it as that for now. We need to try and get into better crossing positions. Let's see if they got on now. We need to get those balls into. Big tackle Roberts. Oh, and then you do that! <laughs> Touch. He his first touch is horrendous every time. And what is that? Oh, it's making me angry. Oh god, I'm falling apart. I'm just doing stupid shit. Deal with this. Morley. Oh, it's horribly wide. I think it's too late for us to do anything now. I don't think we're going to score, to be honest. The amount of chances we missed. To get the corner, I didn't want to whip that in. I'm just trying to play for an easy goal. There he's got, I've still got a score, but it's my best chance, I think, at the minute. home loss. We don't seem to be very good at home at the moment. We seem to be much better away from home. <sighs> it's three points that we should have got that we've lost and we dropped down the table. I think we might be in sixth or seventh now. It's not great. Really not great. Watford 1-2-1. One, one. Where do we sit in the table? We sit in fifth. To be fair, we're only... Who's top? We're three points behind top Norwich. Sheffield United are up there, Preston up there, QPR just in front, Derby just behind, Watford just behind as well. Where are Cardiff in the league? So Cardiff sitting ninth after that win. They go one point behind. It's going to be a tight league, I think. Very, very tight league. As you saw there, we've got Middlesbrough next and then Huddersfield after that. 
Let's have a look at the, the top scorers. Are we in there? We are. Cornet's on four. Surely Vidra's got to be in there somewhere. No, Bodu's there with three and three. Morley with three and six. Ah, no, Vid that's interesting. But anyway, guys, we're going to end the episode there. Not a great one to end it off with, but it was a good, good start to the episode. But hopefully next episode is much better. We bring in Nets as a left back. His development has been complete, it says. That's great. We'll see if we can get a big win against Middlesbrough next. But until then, guys, look after yourself. Stay positive. Bye.